Nelson's a hacker to me. Nobody hacks Nelson. <laughs> a hacker is a, very, is a very odd word. It just means one who hacks. I came up with a definition I liked the other day, which is someone who is so interested in things that they don't need to be pushed to investigate them rather thoroughly. And that's what it means to hack Lisp, to hack VisiCalc. You can even hack BASIC if you do it in the right frame of mind. Would you consider yourself a hacker? No. Why not? Uh, I mean, <clears throat> unfortunately, I'm a writer because I have a lot to say. I don't like writing. I prefer programming, but I'm a very bad programmer. And uh, it, it, actually, writing programs is very low on my personal list of priorities. Getting the Xanadu system up, which is now programmed by other people, has been my principal priority for the last 24 years. Now that that's about to start, uh, Maybe I'll have time to do a little spare program. What is hacking all about? What is hacking all about? It's all about whatever it's you. It's every, it's it's everything you ever wanted a computer to be. It's making love. It's 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 being aggressive. It's uh, stalking into the unknown and seizing the unknown and, and kicking it and finding out that it's exactly what you didn't intend. And all of these things, either in the in the. Uh, peculiar imagined world of the adventure game or in the investigation of an operating system or programming language, all of these are effectively the same. In fact, adventure games are really uh, uh, allegorical system, allegorical presentations of hacking because the people who like adventure games are computer types. I can't stand adventure games because you have to keep trying things out in this boring, methodical way. But I'm not interested in that. Some people are.